There are a whole bunch of different optics in Black Ops Cold War, and they look almost exactly the same, so which one should you guys be using? Let me tell you. What is going on, Angels? The Champ Strider here. And I know this is probably the uh, the sweatiest Call of Duty to ever come out with the thick skill-based matchmaking. Everyone's slamming G Fuel, got sweat dripping down their brows. And everyone's looking for a little bit of an advantage so you can have some more fun. So today we're going to go over which optics are the best because Treyarch gave you like 10 different red dots that look almost exactly the same. And if this is your first time in the channel, become an angel by hitting the subscribe button because you know I'm not going to waste your time and I'm going to get right into the content. So let's hop into our loadouts. All right, so as you guys start getting some weapon levels unlocked, you'll notice that you get a whole bunch of different red dots and hollow sites that all kind of look alike. And we want to figure out which was the best one of those. And when you're looking at optics, you want to figure out which one gives you the clearest view and blocks up the least amount of your screen. So you can actually tell kind of in the armory which one's going to be the best. Like if you look at this quick dot LED, look how tiny this little circle is. So you don't have that good of a view in on your target. But then if you look at, which I think is probably the best one, is the Microfex LED. Look how much bigger the image thing is and how thin the kind of railing around it is. So you get a really clear view. And even if you just look at everyone real quick through the armory, you'll kind of get a vision of which ones are going to block up the most the most room on your screen. All right, so if you look at the first optics here, the mill stop reflex, uh, it's not too bad. It's got a nice, nice clear image with a red dot. But look how much uh, this like square thing kind of blocks up your screen. So we want to get rid of that and let's switch up our optic real quick. Now, this right here is the best optic, in my opinion, and I don't really think it's debatable, but look how much clearer your image is on the Microflex LED. And this is what we want right here. We got we got a thin rail around the uh, around the site, and we got a big image picture, so you can kind of stay on those moving targets when you're tracking them. Now, if you want another example of bad optics, look at the Hawksmoor right here, and look how much of your screen this blocks compared to the LED. So now that we know that the Microflex LED is the best optic, you can actually go change the reticle if you click the Appearance tab in the Gunsmith. All right, so now that we're here, click reticles, and you have all these different options for which reticle you want to use. And this is kind of a personal preference thing, but uh, I did notice sometimes with the red optics in this game, for whatever reason, like look at this one, it's a little bit more pink than red. They sometimes get a little washed out on maps like Satellite, where it has a very red color palette, or something like the snow maps, where it's very white. And if you look, there's a lot of white in this uh, in the red for whatever reason, and the optic can kind of get washed out. So I have been playing around with this green optic right here, and uh, for whatever reason, it stands out really well against the color palette, so I found that you don't ever lose the optic in the light. But at the end of the day, the reticle is one of those personal preference things that you're going to just use what you're comfortable with, and like it gets that super sweaty like uh, micromanaging the meta thing, like in Warzone where everyone uses the blue dot because it'll get you a kill one time in 100 that the red dot wouldn't, but you know... Go with what you like. All right, so there we go, guys. The Microflex LED is the best optic in Call of Duty Black Ops Cold War. Again, hit the sub button, and I will see you guys in my next video. Champ, out.